Hey guys, Daryl here from Love the Bike TV, where it's all about loving life on and off the bike. This week, um, over here in Belmont Estate, which is um, a place where they produce the cocoa for chocolate. And um, yeah, everybody loves chocolate. Good place to be. We just like coming here as a family. It's kind of a chill little spot to have a nice little time. All right, so I got my friend Tizzy with me today. And there's a reason for that, because I want to talk about dogs and I want to talk about bones today. There once was a dog, he had a really nice bone. He looked over, he saw another one laying on the ground, dropped his first bone, went over to the second one. The story continues, I'll tell you in a minute. There's another dog that had a bone. He had a little bone, saw a bigger bone, dropped his bone, went for the bigger bone. The story goes on and I'll tell you in a minute. So what that whole thing is about and what Tizzy and the Bones is all about is that we all got bones, you know? We all got things that happen in our life. We all got basically what happens on a day-to-day -day basis. It's our life. Most of the time it's really good and it's really cool. And a lot of times people start thinking, oh, but it'd be so nice to maybe do that instead. And they kind of give up on this first idea, thinking that the second idea is gonna be better. And then in the whole process, they've lost the first bone, went to the second one and realized, you know what? This wasn't as good as what I had before. Then there's also the situation where maybe you don't have everything you want. You don't have the life you're after. And that's when it's a good idea to drop the bone and go after something that's a little bit bigger. So it's kind of a tricky thing, you know. I always talk on these Loving the Bike, bike episodes about like going after your dreams, searching for what you want, believing in yourself, doing it all, which is totally true. But there's also a flip side where sometimes if you got a good situation, like I know that's my problem. A lot of times things are really good and I just think, oh, but I want something different. I want something better. I want something more. And you got to realize, just take a look at the bone you're holding right now. Is it is it worth giving up? And risking chance of going after something that might not be as good or she just hold on to what you got and appreciate it and love it so d decide which kind of bone you're holding in life if it is a big bone i'm telling you right now just keep keep it it's a good one and um we'll see you guys all in the next episode ciao guys